hello you guys welcome or welcome back to my channel if you are new here hello my name is skyler if you're returning thank you thank you so much for returning um coda is eating dinner right now coda, if you don't know coda coda is my baby she is a three-year-old um lab slash husky and right now it is 8 40 um on a sunday night so I just kind of want to open this vlog with you guys because I only uploaded one video this month and I have actually really, really um, missed you guys. I started um, the spring semester back up this um, this month and yeah, just just kind of like a new, a new, what do I say? Like it's a new year, right? It's, a, it's the first of the month. It's going to be the first of the month. Um, I started school, so just like a lot of new things but i am so so happy to have you guys here and yeah so this video is gonna be maybe like a work week in my life a week in my life i'm not quite sure but today is a today is what the 28th or the 29th we are closing out january and sorry i'm out of breath because we just came up from walking coda and i just been gathering all the things to make um, overnight oats. And then right now I'm hungry. So I made myself, I'm going to make myself a little late night snack with some PB&J. Actually, I'm going to use some Biscoff creamy cookie butter. Is this the healthiest thing? Probably not. But my man, um, he likes to eat this with jelly. And it just tastes really good. So I'm going to put it on bread and then add some banana on top because... I need to use the banana already but tomorrow i work at seven on the dot in the morning um but i just want to make my overnight oats on tiktok if you haven't followed me over on tiktok go ahead and do so because i post a lot on there if i don't post every every day i post like every other day if not every other two days um but i'm very very active on there basically um so i had made a video talking about my overnight oats and the girlies on there wanted to see how i make my overnight overnight oats so i'm gonna film that on there and then i'll catch up with you guys after that but before i close the camera right now i wanted to show you guys what we got at target today so next month is february and look at the little lazy susan that i got going on here it's so cute so i got this little plant at target this at either dollar i think it was dollar general this candle from H-E-B and then this, um, I forgot the proper name for it, but from Hobby Lobby. And then I also got, because it was, it was time, babes. Some new, some new shoes from Target. Um, these were $32.99 and I wear a size, um, six, but I got a six and a half so I can wear with socks um because i have like thicker socks but how cute are these i don't have anything like this they're like this brownish nudish suede like type thing and they have a gold buckle on the top but they're so freaking cute and then that was one of my newest newest pickups another pickup was this towel tumbler i posted about it on my instagram so if you're not following me on instagram go ahead and follow me on there um i'm pretty active on there as well but this is from jesus i'm gonna go close the door because he was being loud but this one is from walmart and i love it because um i'll show you out very very quickly I already refilled it, but so the top has a stopper um, and the straw, like whenever you put the straw, it'll stay like this so it won't leak. I'm very clumsy. My passenger seat, I hate to say it, but I just got it cleaned with you guys like maybe two months ago, like deep cleaned where they shampoo the seats and everything. Um, and tell me why the passenger seat is back to being dirty again because i dropped my water i dropped my coffee and it just leaves like these stains on there but my point is that this has saved me from getting even more stains on there and then i haven't used this because i'm a straw drinker i just drink so much more water when it's coming out of a straw um it, you pop this up and you can sip it oh two things i missed from getting from target so this was from walmart the little thing the little plant that i showed you guys look how cute she is this one is from target and then let me show you all these other two. this faux plant from target as 
well she's cute it's like a little snake i think they call it the snake plant um she's cute i wanted some home decor and i just felt like plants real fake just kind of give the homey vibe that i was looking for so definitely incorporating some little cute plants um to the home is just more cozy and more homey for me but this was really cute and i have it on the shelf on top of our little coffee stand area and then i thought this was super cute this is i think you call this ceramic right um it says xoxo right here and it's like a little motorcycle she's so cute so i just have her like this on the stand but yeah these two are from target this was five five dollars and this was five dollars so five dollars never hurts anybody but go ahead and go to your local target for some cute valentine or home decor let me stop rambling and do this little tiktok video and then i'll check in with you guys in a little bit i'm done filming my little tiki talk but my thing here my thing is hold on this isn't the best lighting but my thing is if you know that you have work the next day this is me getting after you guys if you know you have work the next day you know that you take forever doing your hair your makeup whatever the case may be or you know that one of your goals is to be more presentable why don't you start making um putting your office together the night before and laying them out i promise you it's a game changer i don't do it every night i'm not gonna sit here and lie to you guys i don't do it every night but i do it most nights and that's what matters because when i do it like tomorrow i have to be at work early in the morning i know that right so i get my nighttime routine started um even earlier than i usually do but i have my little outfit set out for the day um this is what i think i want to wear i kind of have an idea of what i want to wear if you don't if you're not getting your clothes ready the night before at least start thinking about it the night before right start thinking about how you're feeling about your body how you want to be the next day what you got going on the next day so you can start thinking about the um, items that you have in your closet stuff like that i promise you it makes a world of a difference but i think this outfit is going to be super cute i have this black long sleeve with these gold little botones um and then i have not worn these pants to work they're like this mustard um color they come with this belt and then i think these shoes go well that's why i brought the shoes over here because i wasn't sure if they would go well with this outfit but i think they will because they have gold and then the gold here so i think it'll work out but i'm gonna leave this here but yeah that's what i wanted to tell you guys is just try bringing out your clothes the night before and i promise you it's gonna it's, it's gonna change the game but look at code <laughs> i was gonna say i need to get off the phone with you guys i need to get off <laughs> hey mama hi my love no i really need to get off this camera and bring my computer and my ipad to bed so i can finish up my last 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 um little i don't even know what they call it quiz um so i can turn that on because that's due tonight but yeah i wanted to open up this vlog with you guys and i will see you guys in the morning tell them good night coda Good night, my friends. Whoa.
it's dark outside the sun is nowhere near out but um i go in early today and the good thing about going in early is that you get out early right but it's fine because i just think about having more time with coda when, oh look the sun is coming out let me show y'all okay i know y'all saw the sunset not my windshield being dirty but i did a little ootd video on TikTok. i have my overnight oats ready to eat for when i get to work because i am hungry i didn't even make a coffee i don't usually make coffees on monday just because i don't have the time um i already wake up like five at 5 30 so you know i'm fine with not having my coffee at home i'll just have it at work but i will see you guys after i guess after work hello my loves it is 5 48 in the afternoon and i not recently got to work I gotta work actually later today. Hold on, let me prop y'all up real quick. Yeah, I got out of work a little bit later today. Um, I got home and I immediately took off my makeup change because I was uncomfy. Um, you know whenever you're like in the clothes for too long and you're just like, I can't wait to get home. I look like bald. <laughs> you're like, I can't wait to get home and just change into some comfy clothes. And I changed into these clothes specifically because I do want to do um, some stretching tonight um, and before I take a shower. So I don't want to like do that in my pajamas. My pajamas are clean. Changed into like this sweatshirt and some black sweatpants. Um, we bought DiGiorno pizza, but the croissant crust. Um, I've never seen that before. I've never tasted it before, but it looks so good. So I made, not made it, but popped it in the oven um and then i made a salad so we can have like on the side of the pizza i just we didn't have much just like tomato onion and lettuce let me tell y'all what happened um today i went to go buy the pizza right and leaving getting the pizza i found no joke 600 dollars bills i mean a hundred dollar bills but six of them on the floor just like kind of thrown and so it kind of looked like too perfect where the area was and too perfect of a hundred dollar bills i mean like they were kind of like folded up a little bit but i don't know like what came to my head was like oh my god like that's a that's hundred dollar bills like no one else has seen this like it, like i was the one to see this so i go to it and like while i'm going to it it's not that far like it's literally from one from i'm one at one island to the next you know what i'm saying from yeah you know what i mean like not that far basically so i'm walking to it and while i'm walking to it like my thoughts are just like what the hell like not one not one part of me like said i'm gonna keep this right i'm just like so shocked that there's freaking i didn't know it was six hundred dollars at, at the time until i picked it up and, and all i could think about was those videos that you see like on instagram or tiktok where they just prank you it's like what would you do type of thing um but yeah, I picked up the money because like I'm not gonna leave six hundred dollars. I mean, like the hundred dollar bills um there. So I pick them up and I'm like walking on innocently, right? Like I don't want someone to turn around or anything to happen where I'm like putting it in my pocket or like holding it too tight or anything like that. So I'm walking innocently and I'm taking it to the customer service, um, you know, to let them know that I found this. And at first, they didn't believe that it was mine that that I had found it. And I was like, yes. It's six hundred dollars, so she counts it, and sure enough, it's six hundred dollars. Um, and then, so I'm like, okay, whatever. Like, I'm just gonna cool. Like, y'all got it, perfect. Um, and then I go get my cart this time. Um, and on my way back with my little carrito, I find a freaking phone. Like, I found a phone. What what is what is going on? You know, like I'm just being blessed in all these all these different ways. Like what is going on? So I pick up the phone and then there I go to customer service and they start laughing because like what? Why do I keep finding all this stuff? You know? So long story short, I'm testing my luck. I never buy lotto tickets. I grew up in a lotto fanatic household. Um my grandma loves playing the Botteria one. So yeah i just i don't buy them um but today we're gonna we're gonna try it out test our luck today so let me get a knife real quick but i have these chips right here because i wanted to tell you guys about them because these chips right here i haven't tried them until yesterday babe the whole bag is gone 
I took them to work and my man liked them. I like them. They're healthy. My um, friend from work liked them. They are the Siete Chili Lime Potato Chips uh, made with coconut oil. Babe, these are healthy. I feel like I could make these in the air fryer. But I, the way I love this bag, like it's just so good with some lime and some valentina. I didn't try it that way, but I just know my mouth is watering while talking. But I just know that'd be bomb. But anyways, let's scratch off this loteria. I don't play because I feel like those my dollars can go somewhere else. You know what I mean? Like I ain't got money to be playing with it type thing. Okay, so our numbers are 9, 10, 26, 31, and 36. Wait, 9, 10, 26, 31, 36. So I think 36. Is that how much? 25, 40, 17, 15, 30. Wow, $30. So I got a 36, a 9, a 9, a 26, and that's it. So I got four numbers on here, but do, am I supposed to add them? The 36 is $25. Let's add them on my phone. I don't know what what is going on in the universe today, but... I am lucky. I just want a $40. Wait, I just want $40 on a $5 ticket. So let me count it again. $25 because I got a 30. 10. 50? <laughs> How do you miss using a calculator? Let me see. <laughs> I don't know. Hold on, my math didn't do it for me. It's confirmed. I want $50. I want fifty dollars. <laughs> what the heck? That's so weird. Should I start a business or what? <laughs> my my luck is like, yeah, I yeah I don't think you understand it. I I found six hundred dollars in the most like obvious place, but I found it. Then I'm like, okay, I turn it in. Then I go go about my business. Then I find a phone. Right, and then I go turn that in, and then I test my luck, and I won fifty dollars on a five dollar ticket. I don't know what to say. I don't know what to say. Anywho, we're about to eat some good pizza with some salad on the side. Um, good morning, you guys. I know it's the next day, but this is what I'm having for breakfast. This is a iced um chai with matcha cold foam and i have like my little tutorial up on tiktok i'll probably be making a updated one um when i get new cups in but this is so so good and then i have some 25 calorie some 25 25 dollar <laughs> calorie tortillas i have three of them i put some turkey underneath i mean on top and then some egg with avocado t slices and um, i don't know why i can't speak this morning avocado slices cheese and some salsa so this is my breakfast i cleaned today the whole entire house not deep clean but you know picked up everywhere so i'm very kind of grumpy and i just want to eat my food but i will see you guys um in a little bit hello you guys it has been a couple hours later since i last talked to you guys about like my little breakfast uh i was filming on my camera so it isn't the best um and i wasn't in the best mood either so i didn't want to pick up the camera with you guys and just give y'all like my half ass like personality i guess um but that's why i didn't pick up the phone i mean the camera earlier but um like i said it's already 11 a little bit past 11 and i am just not getting my day started um the way i wanted to basically because i woke up and i was just like dragging the whole entire time i didn't um wake myself up my man actually woke me up because coda was waiting for me by the bed to take her out and so i was like dragging basically um but i have responsibilities you know like my coda and i gotta take her out so um, I got up and I told myself like I was not going to get back in the bed and I didn't. I automatically made the bed. So the bed is made. So kudos to me. Um, I definitely have to give myself a pat on the back for little things that I kind of push myself to do. And that's definitely something that you need to do too. Um, I don't think we give ourselves enough credit for everything that we do that we don't want to do. But yeah, that's my little spiel for right now but yeah this morning was kind of difficult not gonna lie um i was just sitting on the couch just like 
like I didn't like nothing was fulfilling me like I didn't want to be on my phone I didn't want to watch YouTube I didn't want to do anything so I just kind of forced myself to I the bed was made I just kind of forced myself to pick up around the house I vacuumed the carpets um, I swept I vacuumed the entire house I put the dishes to the dishwasher um, and then yeah like I, I did that um, I dusted every all the appliances in the living room and stuff like that and I disinfected our bedroom but now that I feel like my place is together and I took a shower um, I feel much much better and I did my hair a little bit differently I did my hair kind of up this time like instead of the bun being just like flat I kind of put the bun forward and I kind of like it y'all let me know if y'all like it I'm all, <laughs> I'm all breaking my neck so y'all can see it but I cannot see myself I don't have my glasses on I actually want to wear contacts today so I have my oxy shred right here um, just to give me some energy I didn't have a coffee this morning instead I had the matcha that I showed you guys or the iced chai with matcha on top it was really good something different um, rather than my daily coffee but yeah I have my oxy shred here um, and I'm gonna put my contacts on um, probably just brush my eyebrows maybe um, curl my eyelashes but I'm not gonna add anything to my face I want to give my face a break and then I'm gonna film a quick um, TikTok video for this company that sent me over some bomb leggings their brand is um, OQQ and they have some bomb leggings like before I say yes to any brand or reach out to any brand to work with them um, I make sure that I'm gonna like their product so I make I make I do my research um, on TikTok, on YouTube whatever the case may be on Instagram check out the profile um, check out the reviews and a lot of the reviews have been good and one of the main um, facts of me I mean one of the main facts one of the main reasons <laughs> One of the main reasons um, for me like uh, collaborating with this brand is because they are short girl friendly. If y'all don't know, I am 5'1 and I will consider myself a medium body type of shape girl, I guess. I'm a little bit bigger on the bottom but i am like just like a chunky girl i guess um i just always been kind of a chunky girl so they were the the reviews that were being made were by kind of like the same body type um and the girl that did the review she was like five two i believe and i'm five one so the pants the leggings fit her really good and i was like okay this is perfect like i want the i want the leggings i want to collaborate with them and they're gonna fit me well so i got a size medium uh, i'll show you guys in a little bit but let me get started with this um and get started on the tiktok that way i can be done with that and then focus all my energy to you guys but yes let's just i'm just gonna try to shift my mindset um today is tuesday so it's still the beginning of the week um we still got a lot of days and hours to finish this whole week you know so i'm just gonna push through push um strong and yeah let's put these contacts in so i can finally see what the hell i'm looking like to you guys i am headed out to go walk coda on a nice little walk because lord knows i need it and coda needs it this is my little outfit well let me show you what i have in my fanny pack first i have this pepper spray um some poop bags just grab it and throw it in our little pockets or a little fanny pack but i'm just gonna throw those in here my beats my phone and some sanitizer so i'm probably gonna take my little alarm um that's on my keys that'll make like a loud noise um just for safety reasons you know but poop bags um in here and yeah i finished my oxy shred um this is the one that i take i feel like i've shown you guys before i think this is the yeah cosmic blast um it's a pretty good flavor um but i'm pretty sure there's a better out there like i really wanted the kiwi strawberry but they were out of that one so i got this one um it was the last one so i was like well that has to say something so it's pretty good um i still have a lot of product in there but yeah that's that okay i have my sweatband on because when i take coda on a walk um i mean when i bring coda back up i'll probably head out to the gym these are the shoes that i'm going to be wearing 
just have this pullover on a baby pink pullover and then my little fanny pack the leggings that i made a review on super cute very high waisted um it provides like compression which is my favorite and then they're like um flared at the bottom and i just have my little mom nikes on but yeah let's head out for our little walk Where's the baller? Where's the baller? Hey. Hey guys, we are back from being outside. It is kind of, no, it's not kind of, it's, it's warm outside. Um, we were out there for around like 45 minutes maybe. We, we walked a whole lot, we played a whole lot, so she is tired. But let me share the importance. I don't think y'all can see it. There y'all go. Um, the importance of cleaning your dog's feet before they enter your house or your apartment, whatever the case may be. Um, I always clean Coda's feet. Now, don't get me wrong, there's some days where I'm like rushing and I don't clean her feet, for, but for the most part, hold on, it's too hot. <laughs> I just grabbed some, let me show you. Get these baby um, unscented or fragrance-free um, baby wipes. And I get those from H-E-B. They're literally like, what, a dollar? And they come for they come with 40 wipes. Okay, I shouldn't, I probably shouldn't be on top of the dishwasher because it's too hot right there. If they're good for a baby's bum, they're good for your dog's feet, okay? So you don't need to get the wipes that are advertised like on Amazon. I mean, you could, right? But if you just want to save some, some money, just grab some baby wipes, fragrance free of course. Oh, I also have a package that was delivered. So I got a whiteboard for my office at work. This is the one I got, super cute, and it has like that cork board um, at the bottom, which I can just like pin to-do lists or little sticky notes. But I've been wanting one for so long, and I got the dark brown one so it can match with my desk and stuff. So that recently got delivered, but I can pick that up like on my way back from the errands that I'm about to run. So let's go to notes and do our little to-do list. So first, let's stop at the gas station for our money. And then we'll do the car wash, wash our car, and then Walmart um, for bows or slash ribbon. To make the bows um, and ooh, um, nachos what else did I want to do I wanted to oh pick up Amazon order Amazon order so that is our little to-do list for today um, let's head out to go do what we gotta do. I have Bluey on for Coda because what else would she watch? So let's head out. I am in my car. We went to go um, wash our car. My car feels so fresh and so new. I'm gonna put on the AC because it's kind of. Um, I went to Walmart. What else did I do? I went to go to. I went to go deposit some money. I have to catch myself because sometimes I talk too fast, and I'm not giving myself a chance to think what I'm saying. You know what I mean? But I went to go deposit some cash into my bank like at the ATM um, I didn't, I'm not a big fan of like walking around with cash but I went to Walmart we're actually in the Walmart parking lot and y'all yeah, I actually went in and came out with what I came for like nothing more nothing less oh my god it's so hot like time to jump in the pool literally and it's just 71 degrees outside um I got some chips 
for our nachos. So some tostitos, tostitos, crispy rounds. I got those, I got some jalapenos and some cheese. I was gonna get two, but I don't think we need that much cheese. So that's what I got for our nachos um, for tonight. I am hungry, you guys, so I might check if there's a, um, let me get my phone, to check if there's like a Jamba Juice close by so I can treat myself to like a acai bowl. I used to love, I feel like there isn't gonna be one near me. Oh, excuse me. Yeah. There's oh, I didn't even finish putting out what I got. And then I got the baby pink, um, like, it's like silky ribbon to do my bowls. And then they had, well, this is like kind of like an off-white. I wanted more like a real, real um, white. But I don't know, looking at it now, no, it still kind of has like a pinkish, beige tone to it. I'm so happy to put this in my little bows, I mean my little bows, to create little bows and to just add them to my buns and chongos and braids. How freaking cute. I'm so glad that I got these. Um, I don't even know how much they were. I think they were like $2 each, if not less. But I don't know if I should go home or if I should go to... Um, to smoothie king whatever let's go to smoothie king i i deserve i deserve y'all driving in a clean car just it just hits differently like i hate whenever my car is a mess and i just don't like being in it like babes hello um can i try your pb swizzle smoothie bowl Y'all are out of smoothie bowls? Yes, ma'am. Okay, thank you. Ma'am, ma'am. Yes? We have one left. Okay, perfect, thank you. <laughs> what the heck, I was gonna be sad. What do you mean you only have one left? I don't get it. <laughs> perfect, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. This PB bowl looks insane. Look at this. Oh my gosh. It's so freaking good. Let me put the AC on because I don't want it to melt. Finally back home and we're gonna try our acai bowl. Hopefully it's so good because it looks really good. So, damn, they packed this with peanut butter but it's okay because look at this peanut butter. It's insane. Look at this. It's stuck on there strawberry a little bit of peanut butter the peanut butter is super chunky oh my God, I feel like okay let's try it cheers mm. Mm -hmm. this right here mm, it's so good I missed acai bowls Yeah, I freaking love this. My bow on, what do y'all think? I think it looks so cute. I mean, I could perfect it, but I'm not going to. I just threw it up there just cause I put it like towards the back. Um, and then maybe next time I'll try it in the front. They did not have to make this so difficult. Oh, she's cute. Look at her. She matches with my office desk. Perfect. Yeah, this is the one you picked. delicious nachos my man even went for seconds um but they're super super good i have to blow dry it completely 
this time for real for real and then we'll do the overnight curl thingamajiggy with this with this thingamajiggy bob but i wanted to show y'all look what i did she's so cute tell me she's not cute but i love when we make up like that and you love it when i make you mad but maybe we just love like that yeah maybe we just love like that This is how we're looking. I'm gonna spray it with a little bit of hairspray. Does it do anything? I don't know, but it does something for my mental. So, that's how my hair is looking. Let's go pick up the kitchen now because the kitchen is a mess. And then this is also a mess, so bear with me while we pick this up. Okay, I had to change the camera because it died on me, but I already cleaned up my little mess. Now let's pick out our outfit. I have this one. This one's cute. I like this one. I'm very, um, I feel very stylish and very comfortable in this one. But I also have this like, it's not showing up, but it's more like a nudish, peachy um, color. But it is definitely still pink. So we have that one as well and then oh this one's cute i haven't worn this one in a while this one's really cute i can see myself wearing this one tomorrow let's see I need a stretch oh i know y'all heard that yep I know y'all heard that. Oh my god. Cause I'm not gonna lie to you guys, I didn't even stretch when I got on the treadmill. It was a good run, honestly, and I felt like light while I was running. I usually feel heavy, like if I'm gonna freaking break the treadmill or something. Did I ever show y'all our litter, our litter? Did I ever show y'all our little Lazy Susan? It's so cute. I just burnt um, this big old candle, but I turned it off um, just cause. But she's so cute, right? I'm gonna cut these ripe bananas. They're still pretty um, solid, but I'm not gonna eat them like this. I'm just gonna either make banana bread if not um make like a protein smoothie so i'm gonna put them in a ziploc bag and freeze them and use them within the next two days if not i'll throw them out but i don't want to throw them out yet because i know that they are still good but i'm just gonna cut the little tips off and put them in here so I'm gonna go ahead and relax and end out um, tonight. I will see you guys tomorrow morning when I wake up, God willing, um, and get ready for work. But yeah, thank you so much for spending the day with me. I have a lot of fun filming. I know sometimes I'm not the best filmer, I know that. But I have a lot of work to do, but I'm also not as bad as I used to be. So, I will see you guys tomorrow morning. Yes.
the beige shoes um i just feel like it'll tie everything together but let's go accessories This sent to me by YSL and it smells so freaking good. I put some on my arms, but before I make my cafecito, I want to show you guys what I had in my little bag. This little tote bag my mom got me. I think she got it from like Goodwill or the thrift store or something like that. Um, and I've washed it about two times because I just wanted to get like the true color and the true color is beige so it's super cute I like it you can hold it from right here but it also has like, this strap which I use this strap and then it has a first pocket but I don't have anything in here and then it has this um what well, it didn't have this I got this for Christmas from my brother's girlfriend Chloe and I thought to bring it out because February is just around the corner so let me show you what I have in here. I have Kleenex, um, oh, some coupons and receipts, a brush that needs to be cleaned, um, Lysol, y'all, because the flu and the C word is around, is going around like very badly. So I got Lysol. And then I have this pumpkin cupcake, um, body spray from bath and body works it smells good it smells like sweet and i have a pin some lotion and a lip liner so now i have my lip gloss that i'm gonna put in here Let's see what else i have in here i have a body spray this one i still use all, all year round it's like almost towards the end this is the winter candy apple and it smells so freaking good. I just spray it throughout the day. Um, my little winter candy apple sanitizer. I should hang it like out here. I think that would look cute. But then I feel like it's going to slip out. Whatever. I'll just keep it inside. And then I just have my wallet. So that's what I have in here. Sometimes I'll take my um, iPad if i have like videos to edit or like emails to get back to but today i'm not gonna do i'm not gonna take all that i'm just gonna take my bag and what i love about it is my water bottle fits in here perfectly look at that so good because i have to take my whiteboard so i need my hands clear so this is the full outfit how cute i love it the pink bow the pearls 
the pink shirt um the shirt remember it's from clothes mentor the pants are from goodwill boutique this belt i really really don't know where it's from i've had it for literal years um what else oh my shoes are right there but yeah i have my work keys and i'm off um my glasses are from zillow i'll put the name on the screen but that's my little outfit of the day i actually filmed me doing my ice chai um with matcha cold foam on tiktok so if y'all want to see that check out my tiktok but this is how she looks i just put a different um cap on it looks kind of funny but i lost the original cap and i'm gonna take it to work like this and then now i'm gonna make myself a bagel i freaking love bagels i'm like in a bagel kick right now but I told myself I would only make bagels when I'm going to work because I can make really good breakfast here when I'm off. But I toasted the bagel and now I'm just putting cream cheese on top and I'm going to add some strawberry um, jam with some cream cheese and some jam. Perfection. Alrighty, amigas, I'm headed out to work. Hello, amigas. It is now 6.17, and the last time I saw y'all was in the morning. Um, I'm out of work, and I immediately came home and changed into my PJs. I took off my lashes because taking off your lashes is like taking off your bra. If you get it, you get it, and if you don't, then you must have some really comfortable bras. But um, we were going to make... Can I tell them? <laughs> Sure. We were gonna make, uh, well my man was very, very excited to make dinner, right? Um, he was like, don't even worry about it, like I got it. Went to the store, got like some more ingredients for the food and stuff like that. An hour before me getting off of work and the point was for me to come home to food, um, he's like, I was so excited that I forgot to take out the chicken from the freezer. So <laughs> the chicken wasn't gonna defrost in the next like 30 minutes, you know what I mean? So we went to pollo asado. Um, I've had it before and I absolutely love it. If you ever heard of pollo asado or if you're in San Antonio, um, I say that you should definitely try pollo asado. And this will be his first time trying it. So hopefully he likes it. I like it. Everyone at work liked it whenever we had like our little event. But yeah, I just wanted to update you guys. I want to show y'all. I think I don't think I've shown y'all my little PJs. Sure. I love them so freaking much. I love pajama sets. I mean, I love my little nightgowns too, right? But these are just different because first it's like a set, very comfortable, and they have dogs on them. I freaking am in love. I've been saying freaking a lot. I don't know why. But yeah, I'm starving. So we're going to eat. I'll see you guys after I eat. Mm. I think these are onions. They come with some tortillas, some beans, salsas, some rice. And then those are more tortillas over there. Um, I have my manzanita sold and I got you your, uh, mm -hmm. your Dr. B. But yeah, we're going to eat good. I finished eating and I'm not going to lie. I'm kind of upset with myself because I overate because it was so good. But I'm working on being more intentional with what I'm eating. And like I just sometimes like I just like stuff my face. Like it sounds gross, but like I'm just eating because I'm enjoying it. Not because I'm hungry. You know what I'm saying? But anyways, good thing it was like healthy kind of, right? Um, but all in all, I still think I overate. Um, but I cleaned up a little bit and I want to open this package with you guys. I, I'm going to be honest with you. It can be, you know what, on the package. Not that I'm mad about it, but I was expecting something else. Like I want, I want my light to come in. It's like this light that clamps onto your phone. Um, because I've been filming a lot of TikTok videos and I'm not gonna lie, like my TikToks are good, but the lighting could be much better. Like, let's be real. So, um, I ordered a light to clamp onto my phone that changes different colors. It's not the Alex Earl one, but it's very, very, very similar. And that's what I thought this was, but... This is the milk makeup. So the little packaging, so cute. This is the hydrating grip primer. I have seen so many girlies use this on their makeup routine, and I have always wanted it. So when they reached out, I was like, absolutely yes. I think it's because it's their birthday. I don't know how many years um, 
they've been like a business i guess but i finally got it yay i'm excited to use it i feel like my makeup is gonna look so so much better so thank you so much milk for sending this out to me i gotta do a little a video for tiktok showing um how the milk makeup looks on my makeup wait how the milk looks on my makeup whatever y'all get the point i'm excited to use it um and then later on today i want to make these dolly parton's sugar cookie kit um my man is a big big sugar cookie person i'm more of a chocolate chip kind of girl the camera's crooked i'm more of a chocolate chip kind of girl but i've already attempted um to make multiple cho chocolate chips and they taste good but they don't look good like they're not present present presentable so that was my little spill on that but i want them to look like this and we're gonna make them together in a little bit but yeah i want to open up that package with you guys and i'll get with you guys whenever we're ready to make the sugar cookies Since I was a baby, he... Okay, for those of y'all that don't know, um, I grew up with a mom, a single mom of three kids, and that means that my dad wasn't in my life, but I did have this father figure um, that was in my life for a long, long, long time. And long story short, I found out that he passed away on Friday, 